All right, it's just me today, guys, and I decided we'll do something different uh, as per in the title. I want to go over like the top five grand creatures I like to go for to try and get eggs because I'm always going for grand eggs. And I think a lot of people are too, to um, get the eggs, shatter them and craft the grand poached eggs um, used for catalyzing the cinnabar plants. Yeah, and you only can do five a day, but I'm always doing that. So, um, yeah, that's what today's video is going to be about. But before we do get into it, guys, Santa brought me a gift the other day. Look at this. Ooh, wrong buttons. Always, always. Look, he upgraded my Atmos um, Vex Pinion into this, a Phoenix. Guys, I love this thing. So here it is here. That's what happened. I don't know if you remember, I had the Atmos plan, so I crafted it off screen and I got an upgrade. So that's awesome. Um, we'll check that out in another episode. Also, guys, I know you guys saw I got that um, Draco Shackles. Yeah, check this out, guys. Um, I do believe it's in here. Alrighties, Draco Shackles plans. I have one. Guys, look, I have the nine feathered steed wings. Yes, me and God has killed a bunch of fit. No, we didn't. Guys, I requested it in the auctions for 50 rubies per. Because we try to take on one and they're no joke. We will eventually kill one, but I'm just trying to get this stuff ready so we can craft it and have a look, guys. But um, yeah, today's episode, why it's a bit different today is because I've got a lot of grinding to do. And as you can see, I need one more illustrious soul so we can craft this and check it out in a later episode. But I think that's it. I do have other news, but we'll go over it in a different episode. So let's get into this episode. And we're back. I forgot to mention, guys. Um, I will be going over why I go for these creatures. Uh, show you how I defeat them. Um, and you've got to take into consideration, yes, I am going to be, you know, more powerful than a few people. There's some of the stats there. Some people are way more powerful than me, but I just want to let you know, I've been doing this, Goddess and I, on these same creatures, the same way since we were like, I don't know, our power level was 25k or even less, and we still do it now, the same way, because we find they're the easiest. There will be some creatures that you guys might consider easier to get, like some of the young centaurs and things like that, but I don't spend a lot of time at North Mount. And centaurs don't spawn here, just those little, I don't know, those little goat fellas. And um, you don't come across them that often, so yeah. Alright, now to the episode. Sorry, sorry, sorry. One more thing, guys. Um, majority of these things I'll be using the Rigid Expo. You guys know I love this, but you can use any bow. And the reason I use the Rigid is because I try to save the Juro on all my weapons so I don't have to waste agate to repair it. So is that it? I think I covered everything. I hope I did. All right, this time for realsies. Number five. It's the Lime Cray. All right, guys. The reason this is at my number five is because it does take a little bit longer to defeat than some of the other ones. Um, But it does have an easy weak spot, which is there. And its attacks are quite easy to um, dodge or evade. Uh, you can do the same technique with like the yellow lob cray in that but I think that's like a 500 or 800 yard I don't know but it takes longer so that's why that's not in the list all right let's do this all we do is shoot the weak spot that's it I will be using my pet um, but I'm not going to be using my tendon in this because then they waste durability on their weapons and this is so I can save agate down Easy down, guys. Also, you're not always going to get an egg, guys. This is just quick grands to get them down where you might be able to get an egg. Dodge, dodge. That's the only attack you have to worry about, guys. Oh, oh no. Sorry, goddesses in my team. Okay, let's just take that away. Capture a bill. Oh, I don't have my capture bar. Yes, I do. 
I actually need eggs, guys, for today. Oh, and there we go. We got ourselves an egg. Let me just decline these for goddess. Alrighties, first egg from our number five on the list. Whoops. Let's continue. Number four. All right. And now we have the magic raw ball, guys. Um, the reason this is number four for me is because I actually do use a bit of melee weapons on this. I mean, you don't have to, but I do just to make things um, a bit quicker. Um, you'll notice too, a lot of the magic creatures or the ones that we'll be doing in this, um, their weak spots are so huge, but you'll see in this. All right, I do start this off with some melee, guys. All right, let's go. Just to help knock it down faster. You'll see. Down. Weak spot right there, guys. You can't miss it. Also, Richard Bow, because I have a lot of caddy logs. And I love the ammo capacity, guys. And when it's broken, done, I just, just get rid of it. Down again, guys. Get rid of bubble gum. Ready to capture. Let's go. And I'll take another egg. Sure, I said temp. Alright, that's number four, guys. Let's go find the next one. Number two. Wait, wait, number three, I mean. Okay. Oh my gosh. Next, we got the Spy Manda, guys. This takes a little longer than some of the others, but the reason it's here at number three is. You pretty much can't miss its weak spot. It's big fat butt. So let's a go. Pretty much shoot it anywhere and you almost hit its weak spot. Knocked out. Still easy to get knocked out as well. Ah, also two guys. I don't go out hunting for these. It's more like when I'm out doing normal stuff and... I come across them, I'm like, yeah, I'll go for an egg, thanks. And like I was saying, you know, I'm saving durability on all my other weapons and I'm just using my rigid bows. Ooh. What are these rigid bows called? I forget. Just rigid? Doing rigid bow, yeah. Uh, is it ready? There we go. I'll take an egg, please, thank you. Oh, one shot. And an egg not all right cool there's number three all right off to number two guys go away you stupid grizzly okay okay this is number two all right we actually got two well i have two for number two guys and here's one of them this weirdo Ugh. okay i'm destroying this person's base well it's all green who cares let's see if we can just knock him down guys um, the reason these are like number two and that, this, and the other one is, uh, the snake, the mamba. They're easy, you just shoot them. I'm shooting this guy's base, it's much easier than this guy's. We'll have to find a snake and do it, but yeah. I have something better for number one. It's funsies. And these don't spawn that often. Well, they do, they don't, they sort of sometimes, you know what I mean. Ah, uh, that happens sometimes. <laughs> Damn it, I was supposed to go for an egg. Anyways, here's the snake. Yeah, these are pretty much the same as the raptors. That's why they're number two, like I was saying. They don't take long. Uh, don't kill it, please. Oh! Da Damn it, killed it again. Alright, don't do that, guys. Don't, don't kill it. <laughs> You're going for eggs, alright? Damn it. Anyways, let's go find number one. And number one. Okay, and here's my favorite, guys. And the number one on my list. It's a groove swine. Why is it at number one? Uh, I just find it entertaining how quick it is to down this guy. <laughs> That's it, guys. You'll see. There's its weak spot. It's like a stepo. Bam, it's tail. You ready for this? Let's do it. Am I reloaded? Yes, I am. Go, shoot the tail. 
And down. And shoot the tail. Get in there, bubblegum. Uh, we'll try not to kill this one, guys. <laughs> I better call him away now. See how quick it was? It didn't even get up, guys. Oh, now it did. Egg, please. I didn't get an egg. Wow, we only got one egg out of those five I attempted, guys. Um, well, two of them didn't count because I killed them by accident. But anyways, that's my top five um, creatures I like trying to get eggs from, guys. Um, and it was this just in case you didn't realize what I was talking about at the beginning shattering these grand eggs to get grand egg poach pouch poach or pouch hold on guys this stuff ah pouch yeah to use those to catalyze the cinnabar plants all right well that's it guys you guys might have some other um favorites of your own that you like to go for like see this one here it's easy to down really easy but you don't get the egg you need you get crappy rare egg from this so yeah that's it guys um next episode will be something great i know it i got a lot of grinding to do at the moment so i'm gonna go team up with goddess and we're gonna get to it all right later peeps